thing guys sorry for the unflattering angle I always do that don't I um because I don't want to show you but my room's a mess so we're just doing an unflattering angle so that's not in the picture I just want to be happy happy Basically, today me and Tate are going Mother's Day shopping because um, when I'm filming this, Mother's Day is in a week. It's Sunday. Mother's Day is next Sunday. So we're going Mother's Day shopping today. I thought I would film it just for another video, you know, just getting back into YouTube. So, yeah. I'm going to get ready now. I just had a shower. You can probably tell because my hair's all wet. But anyways, I just had a shower and brushed my teeth and now I'm putting makeup on. I'm only going to do a little bit. I'm not going to go all out. We're just shopping. Um, but I don't. I want something. <laughs> I'm thinking I will upload this the Friday before Mother's Day so people can have like inspiration of what to get even though I don't think you'll need it because like <laughs> by that point it's two days away. But yeah, I thought I'll do that. I'll just specifically ask my mum not to watch it until after. So yeah, gonna get ready now. Yep. We are about to have dinner. McDonald's for dinner. Tate's favourite. <laughs> he doesn't like McDonald's. I will show you the Mother's Day presents that I got after I show my brother. I'm waiting for him to get home. The presents are in his room currently. I can't be bothered to go and get them, so I will just show you after I show him. Bye. <laughs> Sorry, it's a bit of a mess, and that there you go. The camera is so bit of a wobbly because it's literally just balancing on a blanket, and that's why you can see the blanket. I forgot to show you what I got, Mum, so I'm going to do that now. Tate went home, so no more Tate in this vlog. He's gone home. He's at work tomorrow. I hope he remembered all these clothes that he that I washed for him. If he didn't, then that's bad. I assume he did. So that was loud, I'm talking. Mum, if you're watching this and it is before Mother's Day, click out of the video, do not watch any further, 
because you need to be surprised okay if this is after mother's day go ahead doesn't really matter because you already know what you got but again if this is before mother's day stop right now stop do not go any further okay you shall not pass type esque thing you know mm -hmm. no click out of the video now mum this is your last warning i know you and i know you've stuck around to this point this is your last warning click out of the video okay let's hope that she's gone hi welcome back um okay so the first thing i'm so sorry <laughs> first thing that I got her is a necklace. Cute. Now, when we were kids, I remember her having a necklace. It was silver. Might have been gold. <laughs> I think it was silver. Um, and it was circle and it had a gem in the middle. I'm pretty sure the gem was red. I don't know. It's hard to remember, like, small details like that. But I remember something similar like that. So... She doesn't really wear much jewellery and she wouldn't have a lot of her old jewellery anymore, unfortunately. Um, which I'm sort sorry. <laughs> I'm sure she's pretty upset about. So I got her a little necklace and yeah, it just says mum and it has a little purple heart rhinestone thingy. I don't know exactly what it is because I'm not a jewellery person but it just looks like that. It's super duper cute. I know this lighting's pretty shocking so hopefully you can see it. Hopefully you can see that it's a, it's a little heart. It is not focusing at all. It is not focusing at all. I'm sorry, but it literally won't focus. I just have to screen so many times and it did not focus. I don't know. Maybe I'll get a close-up of it um, on my back camera, which is broken. But for some reason, when you turn it to slow-mo slow -mo mode, it like works. What is a Mother's Day without fluffy socks? Well, specifically for my mum. I don't know about every other mum. With our family, you, you can't have a Mother's Day without a candle and fluffy socks. So, fluffy socks. And you probably guessed the next one, huh? I kind of gave it away. A candle. Would you believe it? <laughs> it smells good, but it's strong. Um, yeah, it's just a candle. It is... Uh, wild and free sea breeze scented it smells good like i don't know it's really hard to describe scents obviously but it smells good i wonder if does it look like anything oh it's cute on the inside too it's not just the packaging on the outside it's it's cute on the inside you know mum just so you know i'm probably low-key oh i need to take the prices off them <laughs> I forgot about that. Okay, I'll do that later. I'm probably low-key going to steal this packaging from you because it really fits my aesthetic, so. <laughs> you can have the candle. <laughs> I'll have the box it came in. Um, I'm kidding, obviously. If she wants to keep it, she can have it. But if she doesn't care about it, I'm linking it. Um, but yeah, I definitely need to get rid of the price tag. That's kind of important. Um, you can definitely see how much I paid for it, and that's not what you want to see because it's not about the money. I might have to work on this a bit later when I have some more time because right now I don't. Filming a clip for you guys. So we literally just ran out like yesterday um, of shampoo and conditioner. And these are the ones that we had in there. I know that she likes these ones and they're huge and they last us like three months at a time with a family of five, including Tate. So that's pretty good. Restocking these, which I didn't think through completely because it's still a week until Mother's Day so I'm pretty sure when dad goes to the shops he's going to buy more anyways and then these are going to be pretty pointless but like I wasn't thinking about the fact that it's still a week away I was like oh it's tomorrow I don't know I wasn't thinking <laughs> so I was like oh this would be good because like she needs a restock and hello it's still a week away so not smart this is her favourite incense. Now listen, on her birthday, I stocked her up with incense. So, theoretically, she shouldn't need more. But I honestly just took it as a sign that this was the very last one in the store. So I was like, just buy it. She's going to use it eventually. Like, even if she does have heaps still from her birthday last year, she's going to use it eventually. She's obsessed with this one. Um, here's what it looks like. And... Yeah, so I just figured I'd get it anyways, because why not? 
The next two things won't make sense. I really need to get the price tag of this. While I'm describing it, I need to get the price tag of it because the price tag's on the front. So when I go to show you what it is, you're just going to be hit with the price tag. So, um, oh, it doesn't come off very nicely. Brilliant. It's one of those. Um, basically, I learned the other day, like not even very long ago, and I didn't really know this, that mum likes like crystals and stuff like that and she like believes in them or whatever. So, um, I got her a little pack of rocks, <laughs> but like, I don't, because they're not like full on crystals and I literally wasn't even willing to get these, like I didn't, it's not even a thought that crossed my mind, it's just that when I lined up at the counter, these were sitting at the counter and I was like, oh, I'll get them. I can hear her right now, I swear to God, if she comes in, um, yeah, it's called a rock box, so like, does it tell you? Oh, it tells you. Oh, I feel proud of myself. I guessed two of the crystals. When me and Tate were looking at this, I didn't even know that it told you on the back what they are. But I pointed it out. I'm like, that's amethyst and that's rose quartz. That's all I know. And I was right. So I feel proud of myself. <laughs> They're very easy to spot. So like, it's common sense. But I don't know anything about crystals. What about the other ones? That doesn't cover them all. This covers the... Okay, it says amethyst, right? Me looking. You can't even see because there's the box, box thicker in the way. Amethyst is, um, it's hiding. It's it's there. Quartz. There's, like, little pieces of it literally everywhere. I write gold. Fuck. That. That's not very gold. It looks gold on camera. Okay. In person, it's brown. But, hmm, I don't know. It doesn't really... Okay, um, this geodes, I don't know, white. Not really seeing anything white in here, but you know, we'll go with it. Uh, rose quartz pink, I know what that is, and tiger eye brown. I'm sorry, but that does not cover anything. Like, there's an aqua one here, a mint blue one here, a black one here, a bright pink one here. What are those? And another light blue one here. What are those? Anyway, I got her some crystals because I learned the other day that she likes them. So, you're welcome. She also has like a sensory thing where like she really likes like holding in her hands smooth, rounded things. And she likes rolling them in her hands and playing with them. I don't know. She just loves doing that. So, I literally just got her. Oh, can you see the price tag? Yes, you can. I literally just got her like these balls. <laughs> These like little round things that you can just roll around in your hand and it seems silly but I know that she'll enjoy them because she just likes rolling things in her hands and like feeling like a smooth surface to just, I don't know, she likes, it's a sensory thing, I don't know, she likes it. So when she sees it she'll definitely realise who bought the presents. But that's okay because <laughs> um, Josh supplied the money, I bought the presents, you know, it's a win-win. And then the last thing I got her is a bath bomb from Lush. It was the Sakura bath bomb. Imagine the cherry blossom falling softly in a warm, gentle breeze into your bath. It smelled really nice. Is it? What did it say? Does it say? It's, I know it said jasmine. Jasmine. Gardenia. Orange blossom. Okay. Well. It smells good. It's very strong. That's what us kids got for mum for Mother's Day. Yeah, I thought I would just share just in case anyone needs any ideas, even though it probably didn't help you at all in the slightest, but I just wanted to have this up before Mother's Day just in case. Um, highly doubt it helped a single person, but it's whatever. I don't really know if there's much more to vlog. I can vlog a little bit of Naya because she's just cute and like, why not? I'm sorry, I didn't film much in the shopping center. I wanted to film a lot more, but I honestly wasn't thinking about it. I was just thinking about what do I get mum? Kate's family. His mum will just give a list, so it's so much easier to just buy. Good God. But my mum doesn't do that. Like, for Mother's Day and Father's Day, like, neither of my parents give lists, because, to be honest, I don't even know if they know what they want. Like, yeah, so it's just a surprise each year. A surprise, like, <laughs> we always get her, like, fuzzy socks, candles, incense the reason that this year is different 
is because you'd never get her anything like this because I only just recently learned that she likes stuff like this. I didn't know. So this is going to be new. So this is going to be an exciting year for her in a sense because it's stuff that she's not used to receiving. Which, you know, we buy her the same stuff every single year. Um, and then these, like she's not used to receiving these because I just learned that this is a sensory thing that she enjoys recently as well. So that's brand new this year. The jewellery is brand new this year because we don't usually buy jewellery because I never think of it. Not because we don't want her to have jewellery because I literally never think of that. It never crosses my mind until this year when I realised for my birthday I really want new rings because these ones are broken. Like they're broken and every single time I run my fingers through my hair they get stuck in my hair and it pisses me off so I want new rings for my birthday and then Mother's Day was approaching and I was like oh my god jewellery that's a thing that people give like can't believe it took me this long to remember that jewellery is a thing but yeah so the jewellery is new this year so she's going to be excited about that sorry this is really bad lighting so yeah she has at least three things that she's not used to receiving whatsoever so this year will be a little bit more of an exciting year because we usually just set her up with pampering stuff like like bath bombs and shampoo and conditioners body wash candles fuzzy socks new pajamas that sort of stuff but yeah this year's a little bit different so i think she'll like it i love you mum. <laughs> yeah i will probably just get some footage with naya now and then close out sorry just cracked my finger and just close out the video because there's not really a whole lot more to say or do because this was a like Mother's Day prep vlog. So yeah, I'm sorry that the camera is so shaky. So shaky. <laughs> but say. Here is Naya. Not interested in the slightest. Lay down. So here's here's your night footage, okay, that you're all longing for. I'm just kidding. Oh, well, I'm sure you all love Naya. I sorry. Why Naya? What? Should we sign off the video? What? I hope you enjoyed today's video. I hope it helped someone. It definitely didn't, but hopefully it gave someone some sort of inspiration, maybe for their mum's birthday or Mother's Day. I doubt, but yeah. Oh, she's so cute. Look at that little voice. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, follow my Instagram, all the usual YouTuber things. I love you guys and I will see you in the next video whenever that may be. Hopefully on Monday. But we'll see. Bye guys. Say bye Nai Nai. Say bye bye. Good night. Bye bye. <laughs>